back with some more Final Fantasy 16 today in this episode hopefully we'll be meeting Joshua knowing my luck though every time I've said I think we're gonna do that something we don't end up doing it so I don't know what's gonna happen in this episode but we'll see make sure to do the basic YouTube stuff which is liking commenting scribe subscribing and sharing you guys know the drill everybody asks you to do it why would I be any different? Anyway, let's watch the cutscene. <laughs> Mute while I drink my water. All right then. Well, that thing looks ugly as fuck. <clears throat> Boom, bow, bow, wow, wham, bam, thank you, oh my goodness, he dodged me. Oh, wow, okay, was not expecting that one. Bang. Oh my goodness, whoa, that looks crazy. Got him. Ha <laughs> ha. Ah, dang. Just a little too late. Oh. God damn, bro. Can you stop combo with me? Ugly beast. Alright, take that potion. And I believe this is where we're supposed to go, so. Boom. Open. Sesame. Man, this game is so fun. Up. Oh, three more of them. You guys saw that slight repositioning I did just to make sure I get them all with it. That was nice, right? Yo, so easy. So easy, so easy. <clears throat> yes, that is what we're looking at. Well, it made that door open. Duh. So now we follow it down and see where it leads us. Follow the blue brick road, as some may say. Uh, yeah, look, this is the door that got open. I'm guessing we'll have to do that with another door when we're done with this one. We'll see, though. Yeah, some sort of trials that we're going through. All right, bro. That really didn't kill. I should have just mashed some more. Cause you don't gotta do the full 30 hits. You can just end it whenever you want to. That's fine though, whatever. What have we here? What have we here? Mm-hmm. I'm gonna switch back to the Phoenix. It just feels like uh, the best for me. 
So. Ooh, here we go. I mean, maybe we don't need to do it at the door. what it is we can find if we go this way though maybe this is where we gotta find them I know I'm jinxing it by saying that but you know it just feels like this area has been quite large quite a lot of gameplay after a lot of cutscene and walking around and then more cutscene and then talking and then walking around and then fighting and then walking and cutting cutscene and talking and all that Could be. Could be. I don't know. I've never seen a <coughs> Who is that in the middle of I'm so sorry. I thought I muted it. Some sort of god. I'm so sorry. I really did mean to mute it there, but I wasn't able to. Ooh, what's in your ear? Oh, damn, headache. Ah, the ringing is in my ears too. Whoa, did time just stop? How? <laughs> oh my god, please. I'm so glad I have headphones on. My dog's would be going crazy right now. Oh, damn. Well, this one, everybody didn't see. <clears throat> you know? Jill didn't see that one. Where are we? Oh, are we in our mind or something? What the hell? Oh, <gasps> no. I'm back. We did it again. Oh, damn, it's a flashback. Oh damn, bro used Conqueror's Hockey. Young Clive, twenties Clive. Joshua died. I killed him. 
killed him. And I blamed another for what I did. To spare myself the guilt. Yeah. I feared the Bai. Accepting it. I would lose what little was left of me. Wait. Now it makes sense why Joshua is alive. We turned the phoenix to ashes. But the phoenix always rises from the ashes. So that Joshua's soul can finally rest in peace. Damn. Huh. Is that the power of Ifrit that we're getting? Or is that the power of the Phoenix? <clears throat> um, excuse me. Don't tell me they're about to have us fight him. Oh, damn. I was not expecting this. What the hell? We're about to fight Ifrit? Ifrit? Whatever. Boom, 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 bow. Oh, damn. I. Fine. Ow. Did I really miss that? Am I able to target multiple parts of his body, by the way? Actually, I actually have no clue. Why did not move at all? Almost. I tried getting out of there. Didn't work. Come on, bruh. I'm so close. There we go. Got him. Got him. 
Ifrit defeated. Ooh wee. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. We're like that, buddy. We're like that. Excuse me? Um, we beat you fair and square. What are you doing? Oh, what the hell? Oh, we gotta fight ourselves now. I thought I was in the Phoenix. I'm so dumb. Ooh. Yo, that's a cool ass move, bruh. There we go. Boom, got him. Dang. Where'd he go? Where'd he go? Ooh, cinematic stuff. Ooh, damn. Right across the gut. Holy. He's in his partial form. When do we get to use that? Yo, that looks cool. He just used a double trigger. <laughs> Woo. Tell me I'm not whooping his fucking ass right now. God damn, bro. God damn. You're lucky I wasn't in range, bro. Holy, I'm whooping your ass right now, though. Oh, damn. There we go. Whoa. Oh, it's dragging me in too. Ow. What the fuck? How am I supposed to get away from it? It kept pulling me in. I see. Oh damn. Oh damn. Oh damn. Oh damn. We're just going to go all the way out for this one. Ah! 
Ow! No, get off of him. We're going away. Oh my god. Not done yet. What the hell? No escape, eh? It's all right. I'm done running from you. Nah, bro. I was ready to finish the fight. Oh shit! Good, we're good. <clears throat> I'm not muted, right? No, I'm not. Okay, I had to double check. Yeah, I accidentally yoinked my headset out. <clears throat> Yo! This shit look bonkers, bro. Do we get to become full Ifrit now, too? Or do we just fight him in this form? Do it, Clive. It's time. I know the truth of it now. You are not afraid. I am. Ooh! The music, too? Oh, man. Cinematic clash. Whoa, bam! Oh, damn, he punched the shit out of us. Oh, yeah. Punch him again. 
can't overpower me, sucker. Boom! Punch the shit out of him. Ugh, Superman punch. Clap. Ugh. Ooh, damn. Okay. I thought we were gonna body slam him right there. I was like, damn, transition into the power bomb? That'd be crazy. It's over. Shadow vanquished. Shard. Ooh, man. It's not the world that's only. Yeah, we. That's loud. <gasps> Acceptance trophy earned. Clive, are you all right? Yeah, yeah, we're good. We're good. We're good. It's nothing. I'll be fine. No more chasing shadows. The hooded man isn't here. Mm. We should go. Okay. Mm. Are you sure you're all right? Whatever it is, you can tell me. <laughs> I had a hard enough time telling myself. Yeah, well, you wouldn't have to I fight her. I this so. dominant of fire right here in this castle. And I've been running from it ever since. But now I know for certain who I really am. Hmm. The second icon of fire, who killed my brother and burned this castle to the ground, was me. Oof. <laughs> Clive. I took so <clears throat> many lives that night, and destroyed so many more, mm -hmm. including yours. That is true. And I must atone for the crimes I've committed, but not before I learn the whole truth. How can a second icon of fire even exist? And why was I chosen as his dominant? Mm -hmm. Who is the hooded man who brought us here? And what does he want? How many did Sid say there's supposed to be? I think he said seven. And since I'm still or eight. I might as well make myself useful. One of fire, one of ice. One of lightning, one of wind. We'll That's four. Together. Titans probably I'll earth. Maybe light and darkness would make six and seven. Be time for a I don't know. When we're done. I was hoping you'd say that. I don't think I could do this without you. Yeah. We never were one to hide from the truth, even when we were young. And you haven't changed a bit. But she has. You're wrong. 
I have changed. I don't want to be that person anymore. Mm. The things she did were unforgivable. And yet... Yo, I really like her fit too. The white and the blue, they contrast so nicely, just like his red and black. Thank you, Jill. Ugh. It's so lovely. If he is here, then... The disturbance I felt at the care must have been... Confounded. The hour is later than I thought. Bro, what are you doing? You're just randomly watching us? Like... Meanwhile... Bum, ba, da, bum, bum, bum. Castle Dasbog. Oh damn, he's very upset. He got a haircut though. Tell me who did this, or I'll see you suffer the same fate. The man who delivered, who, who delivered the coffin said, he said Sid paid him. Oh, damn. <clears throat> I let you run amok with the rest of your rats, and this is how you repay me? Find out where he is. Yeah, I'd get out of there if I was you. Mm-hmm. Man, dude really loved her. Like, loved, loved. That being said, though, the meaning of life is the next mission. If you're awoken, Clive is gaining control of the icon, allowing access to new iconic moves such as ignition of fiery lunge that drives back enemies while dealing continuous damage, as well as unlocking the limit break gauge. Slots for efforts abilities are shared with those for the Phoenix and can be confirmed via the abilities tab in the main menu. The limit break gauge is located beneath Clive's HP bar. Release Clive's inner beast into semi prime into Ifrit by pressing L3 R3 when the gauge is full. The gauge fills in battle both by taking damage as well as by successfully performing offensive and defensive maneuvers. Semi priming temporarily grants an increased attack potency and speed, gradual HP regeneration, and guard breaking strikes. So, what next? Well, we what's next is y'all talk and then I end the episode. Talk to him again about Lady Hannah, amongst other things. Though she may be loath to leave, I can't help thinking she'd be safer with Sid too. All right, we should arrange an introduction then. All right, we'll do that. All right, so that was the episode. Quite a lot of stuff happened. Still didn't meet Josh. Guess we won't be doing that at all until way later in the game, because now we're leaving him, and it looks like we're gonna go fight the Titan. But anyway, with all that being said, that's the end of the episode. Make sure you do all the basic YouTube stuff. Like, comment, subscribe, share. Till next time. Torgal, what is it? Torgal? Nothing good, I'll wager. Come on. Why are you uh, growling? 
No, no, no. That's the end of this episode. Sorry. Until next time. Bye.